ಹೆಲೋ ಯೋರಿ ಒನ್ ಎಲ್ಲರಿಗೂ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಉಡಾನ್ ದೀಪಕ್ ಯೂಟ್ಯೂಬ್ ಚಾನಲ್ ನಾವು ಐ ಎಲ್ ಬಿ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸಿಂಗ್ ದಿ ಎಸ್ ಎಸ್ ಎಲ್ ಸಿ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಮ್ಯಾಥ್ಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಫೋರ್ ಫೈವ್ ಮಾರ್ಕ್ಸ್ ಫಿಕ್ಸ್ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಅಪಿಯರ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ಮೆನಿ ಆಫ್ ದ ಎಕ್ಸಾಮಿನೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಇನ್ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಇಯರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಮಿನೇಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಸಾಲ್ವಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅರೌಂಡ್ ಫೋರ್ ಟು ಫೈವ್ ಮಾರ್ಕ್ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ಸ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಲೆಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಬಿಗಿನ್ ಅವರ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಷನ್ ಆನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಫೋರ್ ಆಫ್ ಮೈ discussion in the first three parts i have discussed mini questions okay which are related to 3 4 and 5 mark questions kindly don't miss those okay and after that you come here okay or else you can just look into this this will be very much useful ivella bahala ena important adavu okay now id question enaithi i'll just read and i'll let you know the answer in detail for this there are five terms in an ap okay in an arithmetic progression the sum of this terms is 55 and the fourth term is five more than the sum of first two terms find the terms of the ap that means a progression in ap uh, nit we need to find so whenever they give five terms what you should do is you should remember this see whenever they give five terms let the five terms be let the five terms be yena togobeku a minus a idar hindin ela term okay a minus d a minus 2d similarly a the mundin ela terms have general form a plus d a plus 2d so you five terms a minus 2d a minus d a a plus d a plus 2d are in ap you i do terms ap olaga da avant heli togobeku next avu yen anbittidare just nodi illi what they have given sum of this terms is 55 andra ella koodisidaga namge yen bartiti 55 barutte so sum is how much it is 55 so ella terms anna koodisbeku so a minus 2d plus a minus d plus a plus a plus d plus a plus 2d all you add you will get 55 okay now what should you do ಇಲ್ಲೇ ನೋಡಿ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಟು ಡಿ ಮೈನಸ್ ಟು ಡಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸಲ್ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಡಿ ಮೈನಸ್ ಡಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸಲ್ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ರಿಮೇನಿಂಗ್ ಯೂಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಎ ಎ ಎ ಎ ಎ ಸೊ ಯು ಆರ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಫೈ ಎ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ವಿಲ್ ರಿಮೇನ್ ಸೊ ಫೈವ್ ಒನ್ಸ್ ಆ ಫೈ ಲೆವೆನ್ಸ್ ಆ ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ಫೈ ಎ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಹೌ ಮಚ್ ಎ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಸೊ ಎ ನಿಮ್ಗೆ ಏನು ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಹನ್ನೊಂದು ಬಂದುಬಿಡುತ್ತೆ ದೆನ್ ವಾಟ್ ದಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಓಕೆ ಐ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ರಿಪೀಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಏನು ಅಂದ್ಬಿಟ್ಟಿದ್ದಾರೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟು ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಎ ಫೋರ್ ಅಲ್ಲ ಅದು ನೆನಪಿಡ್ಕೋರಿ ಎ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಅವರ್ ಚೂಸನ್ ಎ ಪಿ ನಾವು ಏನು ಚೂಸ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದೀವಿ ಅದರದ್ದು ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಆಗಬೇಕು ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅವರ್ ಎ ಒನ್ ಇದು ಎ ಟು ಇದು ಎ ತ್ರೀ ಇದು ಎ ಫೋರ್ ಎ ಫೋರ್ ಅಂದರೆ ನಮಗೆ ಎ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಡಿ ಬರ್ತೈತಿ ದಿಸ್ ಒನ್ ಯು ಶುಡ್ ನೋ ಹಿಯರ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಈಗ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಏನು ಬರ್ತೈತಿ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ಮೋರ್ ದೆನ್ ಸಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ನಾಲ್ಕನೇ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಏನೈತಿ ಐದು ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಐತಿ ಫೈವ್ ಮೋರ್ ದೆನ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಐ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಟೇಕ್ ದಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಏನೈತಿ ಎ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಡಿ ಓಕೆ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಎ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಡಿ ವಿಚ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಫೈವ್ ಮೋರ್ ದೆನ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಓಕೆ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಅಂದ್ಬಿಟ್ಟಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಸೊ ಎ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಸಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಯಾರು ಆ್ಯಡ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಓಕೆ ಇವು ಯಾರು ಏನೈತಿ ಆ್ಯಡ್ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ದೀಸ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟರ್ಮ್ ಐ ನೀಡ್ ಟು ಆ್ಯಡ್ ಇಟ್ ನಾವು ಯು ನೋ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಎ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಎ ಇದ್ದಲ್ಲಿ ಏನೈತಿ ನೀವು ಲೆವೆನ್ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯೂಟ್ ಮಾಡುತ್ತಾ ಆ ಸೊಲ್ಯೂಷನನ್ನು ಬಗ್ಗೆ ಹರಿಸಬೇಕು ಓಕೆ ಈಗ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಏನು ಬರ್ತೈತಿ ನೋಡಿ ಎ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಡಿ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಫೈವ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಎ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಎ ಟು ಎ ಮೈನಸ್ ಟು ಮೈನಸ್ ಡಿ ಇಸ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಡಿ ಎ ಇದ್ದಲ್ಲಿ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಬರೀರಿ ಓಕೆ ಈಗ ಎ ಇದ್ದಲ್ಲಿ ಏನು ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ನೀವು ಲೆವೆನ್ ಅನ್ನು ಬರೀಬೇಕು ಆಗ ಏನು ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಡಿ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಓಕೆ ಡಿ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಈಸ್ ಇಯರ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಡಿ ಸೊ ಫೈವ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಟೂ ಸಾರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಟು ಈ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಈ ಕಡೆ ಇದ್ದಿದ್ದು ಆ ಕಡೆ ಬಂದುಬಿಡುತ್ತೆ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಡಿ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಡಿ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಹೌ ಮಚ್ ಫೈವ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಟು ಮೈನಸ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಈಸ್ ಲೆವೆನ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ಟೀನ್ ಸೊ ಫೋರ್ ಡಿ ಏನು ಬಂತು ಸಿ
AP that is arithmetic progression so very simple question it is see in an AP sixth term so in any way directly sixth term very both sixth term is is means equal to one more than twice the third term like this we'll got first equation similarly sum of fourth and fifth term so fourth math eighth term no add madidra equal to five times the second term so this two equation will you will get you just solve this and you will get the answer so here you solve mad beku already i have written here a6 is equal to one more than twice the third term this is first equation and one more is what uh, fourth term sum of fourth and fifth term is five times what second term now sixth term how will you write a plus 5d equal to 1 plus 2 into a plus 2d so how much it is a plus 5d equal to 1 plus 2a plus 4d okay now what will you do take a on one side so you'll get equation here a plus 5d this minus 2a minus 4d equal to 1 okay so a minus 2a is minus 1a 5 minus 4 is 1d equal to 1 okay so then you need to what solve this one this one is here a plus 3d plus a plus 4d equal to 5 into a plus 1d okay a plus a is how much 2a 7d equal to 5a plus 5d take all on left side so 2a plus 7d minus 5a minus 5d equal to 0 2 minus 5 is how much minus 3a okay then 7 minus 5 is 2d equal to 0 bandhiti. okay now you got two equation okay here you will got two equation now you need to use elimination method okay so what is that minus a plus 1d equal to 1 minus 3a plus 2d equal to 0 multiply this equation by 3 this by 1 okay so when what will you get when you multiply this equation by 3 minus 3a plus 3d equal to 3 second one i'll write as it is okay so now you should what you should change the sign plus minus minus always this will get cancelled 3 minus 2 is 1d so 3 minus 0 is 3 so directly you got what d is equal to 3 if d3 and in equation 1 you should substitute so substitute d equal to 3 in equation 1 so what is equation 1 minus 1 a d equal to 1 minus a plus 3 equal to 1 1 a is what so directly you can write this directly you can write so this e side okay the minus a equal to minus 3 minus minus cancel a is equal to 3 in the a math d and bartha we are do same d now they have asked us to find out 10th term of that ap so half the net term young marty it is a plus 9d a is 3 9 into 3 so 3 plus 27 how much 30 one sorry 30 is the answer so you got a 10 is equal to move to that is the answer okay i hope uh, you got this one now moving on to the next question okay number nadi mundina prashna yakari okay so let us begin the discussion on what next question okay see the next question is a tower and a pole stand vertically on the same level okay so it is observed that the angle of depression of top and foot of pole from the top of tower of height 60 meter is 30 degree and 60 degree respectively find the height of pole and the question it okay so here you should find what this height of pole yes you should find that is cd now if this is h this is also h and this total is uh, what 60 so this is what 60 minus h is this okay now this is h then remaining is i'll take this as x okay the base i'll take as x now you can see here this angle is what this angle is 30 degree why alternate angles this is angle of depression they have given 30 and the bigger uh, triangle is what this is 60 degree okay now what should you do is you take what in this triangle where uh, you should always start with what smaller triangle okay so how to do this now just start with in triangle aec so this angle is 90 degree so i'll just start writing in triangle aec aec angle e is 90 degree you should mention this okay now what is tan 30 degree in that it is tan 30 degree tan 30 is how much opposite divided by uh, adjacent that is base okay opposite divided by adjacent so opposite is 60 minus h adjacent is x okay so tan 30 is 1 upon root 3 it is 60 minus h by x so you are having what two variables here this is equation one now i will do what in triangle bigger triangle i will take that is a b d so in triangle a b d okay so what will you do in this triangle yeah you need to take what which angle is 90 degree angle b is 90 degree tan 60 equal to opposite opposite is 60 by x so tan 60 is root 3 
60 by x so x will move up okay x root 3 is equal to 60 this root 3 will come down so how much it is so x root 3 will come down so it is x uh, equal to 60 by root 3 but you should rationalize because the answer will be not uh, it should not have root in the denominator so it is 60 root 3 by root 3 into root 3 is 3 so 3 ones are 3 twenties are so we got x so that means base how much x is equal to 20 root 3 okay we got this meter okay now what you should do is in place of this you should substitute okay now what will you do here you take uh, uh, x here okay so 20 root 3 this is 1 upon root 3 60 minus h this is 20 root 3 because in previous you can find here we have found what 20 root 3 x now this root 3 and root 3 will get cancelled 20 will move up equal to 60 minus h now you transfer h here 20 will come on right side so what will you get here i'll just write 20 is equal to 60 minus h so uh, h is equal to 60 minus 20 it is how much 40 meters so we got a height of our that means the height which the required okay the pole is 40 meter i hope you got that now the most important question is what the surface areas and volume uh, question okay many a time uh, this question has been asked in exam okay so i'll just begin with this question now the question is what a container opened from the top is in the form of frustum so they said that there is a container it is in the form of what frustum of cone with height 16 with the radii of its lower I'll, before drawing i'll just read here okay so a container open from the top is in the form of frustum of a cone of height 16 centimeters so there is a frustum of whose cone of height is how much it is 16 centimeters so from here to here it is how much it is 16 centimeter and they said what here uh, with radii of its lower and upper ends are 8 and 20 centimeter respectively that means upper end is 8 and lower end is 20 so what they are telling here upper end radius is 8 centimeter and uh, lower end is what 20 centimeter so r1 is 20 and r2 that is is 8 centimeter okay then what they have said find the cost of milk that means we should find uh, what the volume which can completely fill the container at a rate of 20 per liter they said take pi is equal to 3.14 so you should do what pi is equal to 3.14 you should take and you should able to solve this okay so let us begin the discussion first we should form uh, find what volume so what is a volume formula so volume of first term is equal to v is equal to 1 upon 3 pi h r1 square plus r2 square plus r1 r2 okay so that one you will get here okay so it is 1 upon 3 pi is 3.14 h is how much it is 16 then you should find what r1 square r1 is what the bigger one that is 20 square here it is 8 square this is 20 into 8 okay so i'll just write as it is 1 upon 3 3.14 16 this one i'll solve first 400 plus 64 plus 160 okay now how much will you get this it is 1 upon 3 3.14 into 16 so into how much uh, will you get here 400 plus 64 plus 160 is 624 so when you just multiply this okay and when you just multiply and divide by 3 okay so if you just 3 ones are 3 twos are 6 3 eights are 24 okay 208 you will uh, get okay so then uh, what you should do multiply 3.14 into 16 into 208 you will get what 10459.43 centimeter cube that is the volume you will get we'll just correct it okay because the answer is somewhat last two digit is not missing that is 10449.92 centimeter cube you will get okay now we need to convert this volume into liters so how will you convert this into liters just divide by what just divide it by thousand you will get what you will get it in liters okay that is the uh, how you will get now if you divide it, it then you will get what uh, three decimal point you should move backward that is 4.9 okay this much if you this is the liter then what they have asked here they said to find the cost of milk 20 rupees per liter they said so you should multiply this answer is what with the 20 so what is cost of milk so cost of milk is what v is equal to 10.449 into 20 you should do okay so when you multiply this two you will get what 208.98 so nearly will get what 209 rupees so this is the uh, what cost i have written here v actually it should be what it should be cost okay here it should be cost so cost of milk is what 209 rupees i hope you got this thank you so much